Hello friends, you are watching Android Tech Solutions and today in this video I am going to show you how can you set up multi-factor authentication in your AWS account. Okay, so first of all I am going to log into my AWS account with the root user credentials. Okay, so these are the credentials which you use to set up your AWS account. So you have to log in with those credentials. So here you can see it says root user sign in. Now here at the right top you have to click over here. It will display uh, either your account alias or your account ID. Okay. And here you have to click on uh, my security credentials. And here you will find multi-factor authentication, the second tab. Now here we will click on activate MFA. Now here we will choose the first option which is virtual MFA device. Okay, so we can we just need to install an application in our uh, Android or iOS device. Now here you have to click on show QR code. Now in your mobile phone, you have to open play store or if you are using an Apple device, you have to open app store. And here you need to search for Google Authenticator. So we need to install this application, which is Google Authenticator. We can also use another application, which is Authy. Once it is installed, we'll open it. And we'll scan the barcode. And once we have scanned the barcode, now we have to enter the MFA code here. The third step, which is MFA code. So we have to enter the MFA code, which we are, which is displaying in our mobile device. I'll just click on assign MFA and we have successfully set up the virtual MFA in our AWS account. Now to verify this, we'll just log out from our AWS account and we'll try to log in again. And again, I'll provide my root credentials. Now here you can see it is asking for the multi-factor authentication code. It is looking for the MFA code. So here we need to provide from our mobile application, we need to provide the MFA code. And once we provide the MFA code, we will be logged into our AWS account. So we have successfully set up the virtual MFA on our AWS account. So thank you guys for watching this video. Do like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more amazing tutorials.